interesting way to carry her. Your arm's literally right through it. It's kind of disrespectful. Hello, 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 and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Origins Hidden Ones DLC. I am not going to run through this fort again. That sounds like a terrible idea. In the last part, we made our way to Sinai. We met up, it's supposedly four years after the uh, events of the main game. We met up with our fellow Hidden Ones in a uh, assassin bureau that they have here. They told us that, you know, the Hidden Ones are being targeted by someone, possibly the Romans, not really sure who. Don't really know what the plot of this DLC is quite quite yet, but uh, yeah, we're just doing stuff for him. Gonna figure it all out, I guess. We got this nice new outfit for uh, Bayek. I think it looks super awesome. And so yeah, we're going to take on the quest Rise of Shackalat or something like that. Oh god, these Roman things are everywhere. I just want to avoid them. And we need to reach the lost hidden one on a merchant ship. Okay, so here we are. This is the ship, apparently, and we need to investigate. And luckily there's this tree branch right here that makes it super easy for us. So let's get in the hay. In case there are bad guys here. And uh, let's see what we can find. Oh, there's something right there. These cages are small. Are they for children? Oh god, I hope not. A broken shield of the hidden ones. Osokan was here. Okay. They do look like they could be for children. That's horrifying. Osokan, where are you? I don't know, Bayek. We're looking for him. Calm down. We just started. Poor child. Was there a dead kid in there? No. Okay, good. Ah, these cages for children are atrocious. Yeah, got that. Much and killed. And dead Romans. Someone who disposed of these Romans did so with great skill. It must have been a hidden one. Okay. The merchant was robbed. Curious. Oh, what's that? Dear gods. Nabataean children sold into the quarry as slaves. These innocent souls are kept in an underground holding pen in the quarry. I should go there. Okay. Yeah, the other thing about this DLC so far is uh, the Nabataeans, uh, you know, are in some sort of, uh, or wanting to be in some sort of revolt against the Romans. Appar I'm, I'm sure, if you can't tell by the landscape of this place, they're being used practically as slave labor to mine, uh, to mine things, to work the quarries, things like that. And uh, Nabataeans, I don't know, I assume uh, that's just the native peoples of this, of Sinai or of this particular region. I don't know, my knowledge of like Middle Eastern and African history is minimal at best. Whoa. Of course, it's gonna be guarded. Sokan must be held here. Yeah, this guy. I mean, I could just run up and kill him. Or I could do this. Could, uh, do this. <laughs> yeah, that's more fun. Rescue. We will rejoin them so. Stab him up. Another guy over here. State. Stab him up. I knew you would come. Chain throw this dude. There we go. Pretty good. Can I break this? No. Hi, I'm here to rescue you. I don't know why I'm bending down. Do you want to talk to me? Let's get out of here. Okay. I break this stuff though, because it's fun. Oops. Oops. Sorry. Sorry about it. Don't run into the fire. Come out here. Don't be stupid like me. You must be the great Bayek. Understand this. I investigated the docks and found a woman liberating the children on a slaver's barge. A liberator's behind the pillaging. An Nabataean warrior known as Shakilat. She hands out the spoils to the people and strikes with incredible swiftness. I was following her, but was captured by Romans. She has found safety with the children in a courtyard between the bureau and the quarry. Okay, thank you for the information. Uh, I hope you get home safely. God, this place is like... It's not that Let it's, your hearts be still, children. I am your protector. It's not hard that it's hard to get around, because everything looks the same. Brown. You are so brave, Shakilat! Can I talk to her? Oh, great warrior! <laughs> you are stealing for the workers in the quarry. If you wish to arrest me, you will mm, have to rip fruit. my heart out Yummy. before I take chains on. Eh, do not worry. But your ways may lead to Roman reprisal. You are trying to defend, yet harm could come of your actions. Nick, I am not to blame for their oppression. I am a liberator. You beget oppression. Liberation is a subtle work of art, not simple petty theft. You cannot take freedom. You must create it. I know the shape of freedom. I lived it with my husband here in the Nabatea, before he was crucified like a fly by Tacito. Oop, oop, what happened? 
<laughs> okay. <laughs> there they are. Yep. Sorry, right, we'll take care of them. It's no problem. Hurrah! Stab him up! Now earn your reputation. I will show you how nothing stops me. Okay. There is the so called Liberator! She loved our outpost! There we go. Oh, I killed somebody. I'm sorry. I'm real sorry about it. Where are we going? Where are you going? I'll stay no longer. I will draw the other Romans away from these innocents. Yeah, now we've got somebody killed. There are no more. There will always be more. Well, until Not like the fifth century, us. then they'll be gone. I do not understand what you ask of me. You fight well. A warrior of your kind is rare. Follow our path and you will not regret it. I do not join cults. <laughs> we are liberators and do not abide by the rules of false oracles and tyrants. You are a chosen one. Sounds kind of culty, Bayek. I work for good. I want to help heal our lands. Shakilat, I'm sure you have the car of a hidden one. But... How can I trust a stranger? I work alone to save my people. I only trust myself. We have the same values. You must only decide whether you apply your skills for the benefit of few or all. Look me in the eyes and tell me there will be no more hate, no more war, no more men in chains. Can't. These are all broken by our creed. Your creed. And if I do choose to give myself to it, to believe it, what must I do? Jump. <laughs> oh, well, I'll show you, apparently. <laughs> like this. And don't worry about breaking your spine, it like hardly ever happens. Oh, she looks so scared. Oh, it's so cool! I love it. Okay! That was incredible. I thought I was going to die. You are reborn as a hidden one. <sighs> How do we proceed? We have a bureau and a ceremony celebrating your pledge. I will enter the shadows. Welcome to the Brotherhood. And Sisterhood. Alright, that was super cool. I hope we get to, uh, you know, meet up with her again. I really liked her. Okay, so while I'm here, I do want to take care of at least a couple of these side quests before we continue too far into the main quest, so I'll start with this one since I'm right here. Let this be a reminder that the smallest slave shall operate in the new section of the quarry where other slaves cannot enter. A new mining section called Sheshat's Grotto, that's where I just came from, I was collected a treasure, has been built in order to extract the recently discovered minerals. If you're not claustrophobic, you can see for yourself by reaching the extremity of the quarry's underground tunnels accessible from the seaside entrance. Okay, I didn't go from the seaside entrance, but let's go ahead and do that. Speak to the slave. I can do that, but I don't I don't want to go seaside. I can just go right here. And it is quite cramped in here. Ah, uh, this is the secret quarry the rebels spoke of. It is. And don't mind the bells. I talk about them in like every part. Don't mind them. I heard Aretas killed himself instead of coming here. Wow. Please, Osiris, come and take me. I hate it here. I prefer death to slavery. Nothing a child should ever have to say. Ah, you must be the killer shadow Haganu sings of. <laughs> this is no place for a child. Yes, Neb. You see the hungry eyes on the children here? All bought of a slave merchant on the way of Horus, where he rides his shiny mount. I will kill this sick soul, and you will see the sun again. Thank you, Killer Shadow. You are living up to your good name. Thanks. He will free us. Thank Amun. Okay, so the killer is in the next gnome. We will put a we'll put a pin in it, and we'll go take care of a different quest first. I really hate that they do that. I don't like it at all. <laughs> complained about that in the main game, and I complained about it in the DLC. I know this place is really really small, so it's not that big of a deal. But it's so compact with so much stuff to do. I'm just I'm not having it. I'm not for it. Oh, is this the singer from the beginning? Hi. I liked you. It is. Haganu. The mountains of the Sinai hide the tortured souls of the dead. Hey. What is this all about? Have you not heard? The old necropolis up in the mountains is haunted by all the dead who cannot enter the afterlife. Ah, huh. someone should look into that. <laughs> And it should be me. Let's see. Is that a little bit closer? 
I think it is. It definitely is. So we'll take care of yours, blind singing guy who I really like. Reach the Necropolis Road. Okay, I'm here. Oh, dear Isaac, protect me and my poor wife. I can protect you. Neb, do you need help? My wife is ready for her journey to the Hall of Anubis, but my knees quake with oh, fear. Oh, she's dead. What awaits me at the Necropolis? I have heard stories to turn a young man's hair white. I am headed there. I will take your wife's body, if you like. Would you? I will be a thousand times grateful. Okay. Just noticed Bayek has a little gray in his beard. Um, nope, I don't want to carry her. I'll just take the horse. A pop can wait here, right, buddy? You're good. This horse is also super pretty. Bodies are put to rest in the main chamber. That's nice. And amazing physics that our body doesn't fall off the back of the horse without being tied to it. I have a grim foreboding. Yeah, me too. Always. What fiendishness is this? Oh, Acropolis. All right, let's uh, let's grab her. Nope. The stories of evil may be true. Well, what? Well, what is it? Oh, it's an interesting way to carry her. Your arms literally right through it. It's kind of disrespectful. Oh, it's dark in here. Oh, look at all the um the can canop canopic jars. I don't know how to say that word right. <laughs> Horse freaking out. Do all right, it's just some tr yeah, tricksters or whatever. Luxia. Some bored children. Bored teenagers. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Find the, the source. The storyteller's song may be true. These are the sounds of a wicked spirit. You say so. I think it's just somebody playing a little prank. Break this. Oh, come on. I can't break that? Lame. God, I can't see. I can't. That is so loud. I can't see anything. And this doesn't help anybody. It's too foggy. Oh my lord. I'm like running blind here. Shut up. Why are you so noisy? Okay, sliding here again. Awesome. These are the arms and legs of the dead. Someone is desecrating them. What a sick freak. <laughs> <laughs> Who dares interrupt Ooh. me? I am the incarnation of Set, god of chaos. Yeah, sure he who dismembered Osiris and spread pieces of him all across Egypt. You are a desecrator and a murderer. You are the incarnation of Iset. Come to stitch her husband together. You shall not. Is that like a different name for Isis? I oh, but I have my stupid torch out. Hang on. <laughs> I just stab you up real quick. Boom. There you go. Oh. Just die already, God. Gods don't bleed. You will trouble the dead no longer. All right, well, that was really easy and no explanation of why he's this way. Really? Nothing here except a dead, a dead. There's a dead here. Okay, well, I guess uh, we don't need to know. Oh, that poor man. Smiling like a hyena. Great, yellow teeth, then snap. That's what I remember. Okay, hi. This is the next quest I wanted to look at. I do not mean to bother you. Be off with you. It's none of your business. Goethe has it well in hand. And I never spoke of Teresa. Certainly not. You seem well. But can you find it for me? I left it. I'm almost certain. Somewhere. It must be here in my writings. I discard my writings as I travel. Leaving scrolls as a trail of woe wherever I go. Oh my god. Read this one. Simut scroll one obtained from Simut. Whoa, oh whoa, I've been chased from my home. A band of bandits, unhappy about some previous incident, came in search of me. Gertha and I had to flee. Gertha slowed us down to a crawl. Wherefore have I encumbered myself with such a lugubrious companion? We arrived here safely, however, but Gertha has gone off to sulk, and I must lament my lost treasure alone. Right. Okay, that's another one that will also take us out of the area so we'll put a pin in it and we'll check the final side quest here before we end the part and see if we can do anything with it oh, and what do you is. have to say for yourself the eagle. i must tell the scarab shadows i want the bounty excuse me oh no leave me alone i didn't do anything you're super cute quiet down boy be calm why are you saying such things the bounty hunter is looking for a man with an eagle i will receive gold if i tell them what bounty hunters they call themselves the Shadows of oh, the Scarab. Oh, yes. The Scarab? Ah, Neck. Little boy. I'm not the man you are looking for. That is no eagle. It is a pigeon. <laughs> okay, the Shadows of the Scarab. It is a very brave pigeon. Wait, are you lying? I 
I'm telling the bounty hunters! Yeah, you go do that. The the Shadows of the Scarab, we, as we already know, are um here and here. These two. So, again, that's something else we'll have to take care of. Uh, in uh, in a later date. Yeah, we totally will. There, there'll be no problem for us. But with all of that said and done, I'm going to end this part here. In the next part, we'll continue on with the main quest, doing stuff for the Hidden Ones Bureau, trying to figure out what it is exactly that we're here for, besides just, you know, helping them out because they don't have enough members or whatever. And yeah, if you did enjoy, please let me know in the comments. Leave me a like or a dislike. And of course, you can subscribe if you want to. I'll see you for the next part of Assassin's Creed Origins, the Hidden Ones. DLC. Bye-bye! <sighs>